Welcome to a skill spotlight and rotation guide for Pugilist Monk, a realm reborn starter through 50. To start off a monk with the new Grease Lightning now being a passive trait, you start with this meaning your base GCD recast will be 2.375 assuming no additional skill speed is added. At level 1 we get Boot Shine, delivers a weapon skill attack of 200 potency, it is instant cast with a GCD recast. If you do not know what GCD stands for, hit Boot Shine and wait till your button becomes available again. Congratulations that is your global cooldown on GCD for short. Boot Shine along with many other weapon skills in a monk roster come with certain strings attached, that being positionals and forms. But for now you only have one weapon skill and the Priority is to punch, punch, and punch away till the target's dead. Level before we get True Strike, it delivers a weapon skill attack of 270 potency, 300 when executed from target's rear. True Strike requires Raptor form, but let's keep it simple to just boot shine for now. For positionals guide, please click the upper right corner or follow on screen visual during rotation segment. At level 6 we get Snap Punch, delivers a weapon skill attack of 270 potency, 300 when executed from target's flank. Snap Punch requires Coral Form in a sequence similar to True Strike. At level 15 we get Fist of Earth, reduces damage taken by 10%, it is instant cast with a OGCD recast of 3 seconds. Effect ends upon reuse, this being a OGCD may be weaved between weapon skill GCD, Fist of Earth is rather useless in dungeon, but useful when face tanking out on the field or through solo content. At level 18 we get Twin Snakes, delivers a weapon skill attack of 230 potency, 260 when executed from target's flank. Twin Snakes replaces True Strike, having higher priority to buff your character before True Strike then does pure damage. At level 20, Grease Lightning goes up by 1, from now on your base GCD recast will be 2.25 assuming no additional skill speed is added. At level 26, we get Arm of the Destroyer, delivers a weapon skill attack of 110 to all nearby enemies, standard AoE fix replacing Boot Shine. Number of target priority for this is 3 or more. At level 30, we get Demolish, delivers a weapon skill attack of 80. 110 from target's rear. This applies a dot to said target doing damage over time. Potency on the dot itself is 80 for the duration of 18 seconds. That is 80 potency per 3 seconds, totaling to 590 if done properly. DOTs or dots have a high potency output but require a delay, so avoid reapplying demolish on already inflicted targets. Number of priority targets for demolish is 3 or less. Finally at level 30 we get Rock Breaker, delivers a weapon skill attack of 150 potency to all nearby enemies. Standard AoE fix, replacing Demolish or Snap Punch in priority. Number of targets for this GCD is 2 or more. At level 34 we get Fists of Wind, increases movement speed similar to Ninja's Fleet of Foot. This being an OGCD stands that Monk performs, much like Fists of Earth, there is a 3 second recast. And they replace each other upon use. Fist of Wind tends to be great for town or field travel while lacking a mount. During dungeon, this can be used between trash pulls to maintain yourself near tank. Once in combat, consider Fists of Earth if damage to self is imminent, otherwise keep those legs moving. At level 35 we get Shoulder Tackle, rushes target and delivers an attack with a potency of 100. This is unusable if stunned or bound. Consider this a weaved OGCD with similar potency to melee auto attack if you are familiar with the fight. Otherwise I recommend holding on to this till character reposition required. Saves you the trouble of walking while in Fists of Wind. At level 40, Grease Lightning goes up by 1 yet again. Now your base GCD recast will be 2.125 assuming no additional skill speed is added. Double weaving is a bit difficult if unusable at all at this point. At level 40 we get Fists of Fire, increases your damage dealt by 10%. That includes auto attacks, OGCDs like Shoulder Tackle, and standard GCDs in rotation, such as Boot Shine. Fists of Fire cannot be used with Fists of Earth or Winds, and also shares the 3 second recast. Effect ends upon reuse, simply put, if you are in combat and enemies are within auto attack reach or Shoulder Tackle can get you to them, Keep this on if not consider Fists of Wind, but make sure to swap back to this. At level 42 we get Mantra, a 15 Yom emitted OGCD from the Monk that increases healing action effectiveness by 10%. Standard use for Mantra is during Roomwide or Stack Mechanic into Imminent Healer using AoE Healing GCD. This will assist. 
At level 45, we get 4 Point Fury, delivers a weapon skill attack of 140 potency to all nearby enemies. Standard AoE used to extend the Twin Snake's buff timer. Number of targets for this GCD is 3 or more. At level 50, we get Perfect Balance, grants the monk 6 stacks of Perfect Balance. Each stack allow you to execute a single weapon skill without form restrictions. More so on this during rotation example. In final level 50, we also get Dragon Kick, delivers a weapon skill attack of 230 potency, 260 when executed from target's flank. Dragon Kick, much like Twin Snakes, replaces Boot Shine as both during Formless due to higher potency and when Monk is lacking Leaden Fist buff. At this point, Leaden Fist into Boot Shine will deal 370 potency instead and remove said buff. Thank you to all of my Patreon members as well as any contributors, both old and new. Thanks for watching, click here to subscribe to this channel. If you wish to join Tempest Discord, if interested in joining Tempest Talon's free company in Crystal Brynhildr, finally consider supporting us on Patreon or other donation sites in the description below. This channel is a work in progress and will always seek to improve. Thank you.